Hey guys, welcome to the weekly reading for the sign of Taurus. I hope you guys are all having a good week. As always, I'm sending you guys love and light. As usual, this will be a general collective reading, so please take what resonates and leave the rest. But this could resonate for you if you have someone rising or Venus placements in Taurus. All right? Or you're dealing with somebody that does have those placements. Please take a moment to read through the description box. You can find lots of information there about my services, um, how these readings work, links to my social media pages, etc. So please, I would really appreciate it if you took a moment to read through that. Okay? Taurus. What does my Taurus viewers need to know at this time, Spirit? Right, one more shuffle and we will get into it. back of the deck deck energy ace of wands so there's a new passion beginning here coming out for the overall energy this could be manifesting this could be what you're currently embarking on hmm. somebody's confused to why somebody ghosted them somebody's confused why somebody ghosted them left them behind won't give them what they deserve won't commit to them won't invest in them I'm seeing that here. Moved away from them. Somebody's confused about that. But I feel like that's going to be changing. You're not going to be confused anymore. Things are going to be put into perspective. I think you're going to get fed up with this person juggling you or, you know, not. It's like you're going to be fed up with the juggling or you're going to, you're going to, you're going to be sick of this person not making up their mind about you. And I feel like you guys may be going in a different direction. All right. Or they're choosing to go in a different direction because we have the Queen of Wands here, um, possibly a Leo. The Queen of Wands can sometimes be like another woman or the, uh, you know, the other person. I'm definitely seeing that somebody's choosing to go in a different direction. Somebody's tired of juggling is what I'm seeing here. Sorry, guys, I'm naming the reading. Um, there's an offer coming in towards you guys. But be careful with this person. This person could possibly be in a kind of a lustful energy. But I see that it could possibly have the potential to turn into something long-term and stable. Um, there's going to be some type of secrets revealed, too. But I feel like whatever is going to be revealed is going to be very healing. Yeah, I see somebody couldn't make up their mind. They couldn't make a decision in love here. And I feel like it had something. I hate this, guys. It had probably to do with the third party. That's why they weren't offering you what you deserved or they were ghosting you. It's because they had a third party, guys. They had somebody else that I feel like they were more invested in. All right, so hmm, for this, I'm going to draw. First of all, I feel like some of you guys were ghosted or this person wasn't giving you what you deserved or they cut off communication with you, pulled back their energy suddenly. Something along those lines. So let me get four cards to clarify about that. And then we will take a look to see what's going on in this third party situation. Because this is definitely that. Alright, why did they leave my um, Taurus behind? What happened here? What was there? And why did they do that? Fear. My past experiences made it difficult for me to open up my heart to someone again. I feared you were too good to be true. Hmm. So this person, you made this person feel insecure. Narcissism. I wasn't getting what I wanted from you, so I left it to get it somewhere else. What did I tell you guys? They were juggling because you weren't giving them what they wanted. 
apparently you weren't giving them something that they wanted and that made them go fi try to find it elsewhere is what they're saying like they maybe you were like not wanting to sleep with this person and this person wasn't okay with that but they didn't want to just tell you like well hey we maybe shouldn't be in a relationship because we want different things they just decided to, they wanted their cake and to eat it too tell me more differences i thought you were just playing my mind see somebody was confused I thought you were just playing mind games so I didn't bother. This person didn't know you were being serious about them or that you felt se like had serious feelings for them. Gossip. People said some really mean things about you. Now I don't trust you. What? So there's people gossiping about you, talking bad about you, talking crap, and they believed it. Unavailable. I'm emotionally attached to someone else. I didn't know how to tell you. What did I say, guys? They're more invested in another person. I told you. That's why. All right, guys, so third party situation here. As usual. Unfortunately, as usual. Tell me about this. Illusion. You guys, you guys like were living in this illusion. You like, you didn't know that they were juggling another person or somebody has been trying to decide whether or not they love you or it's just like, that's what it is. What did that card say? I, there was a card that came out. I can't remember which one it was. But this person has been trying to decide if they actually love you or if they don't. If they want you, if they don't. They think that their their mind's playing tricks on them. Sneaky behavior. Yeah, this person's sneaking and like they, they went in another direction. That's why they ghosted you. They're, they stopped answering you. They pulled back communication, energy from you. This person could have said they were one place, but they were actually with this third party. Queen of Wands. Yeah, this person's not going to admit it to you either. They have no intention of admitting to you that they have a third party or that that's why they ghosted you. The, the only way, the way that you're going to get that from this person is that they get caught in it. This person could be a gaslighter as well. What's the strength card? Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, it's like they're they're gonna continue to associate with this person, guys. Hold up, hold up, hold up, goodness. Dropping the whole deck. Yeah, they are still in love with this third party, and I don't see that changing anytime soon. It probably will never change. They're gonna continue to try to associate with this person. They're never gonna be able to leave them behind. The rival, yep. This person, this this third party has more of a hold on your person than you do they're more invested they're more in love have stronger feelings this this third party has a very strong hold on your person they're able to influence your person to do certain things yep what did i say two loves guys difficult to choose caught between two lovers loves both for different reasons this person is having a hard time deciding between you and another person but they're going to choose this other person it looks like as of right now i don't feel like they're ever going to get over this person so it's probably best for you guys to pull your energy back from this person. Yeah, it's like they feel they feel like they're unable to resist this other person. It's like I feel like this person, didn't I tell you? I feel like this person's sexually attracted to you, but I don't feel like it's much more than that. I feel like they're in love with this other person. And yeah, this person, um, this third party could have caught them talking to you. That's probably why they also ghosted you. The third party caught them talking to you. But they're not going to tell you that. I don't feel like this person has any intention of telling you these things. They're talking to their friends about the situation or they're trying to tell you. Maybe like they got caught talking to you and they said it was just a friend. Yeah, I'm seeing that here. This person has been jumping between you and this other person because they can't make a decision. Hmm. Interesting. So that's what this person's been. They've been keeping it from you that they are in love with another person and that... 
they've been trying to wait they, they don't know they can't decide if they have feelings for you or not that's what i'm seeing here all right guys so this is what i have for you this week i hope that this reading helped you Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you could take something from this reading, if this resonated with you to some degree or at, or, or completely. Um, don't forget to like and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Personal readings are open. Check the description box for more information about that. But other than that, guys, I think that's all I have for you. I will talk to you soon. Bye.